Hello all, welcome to Preeta's Travel Diary and we are going to explore Christchurch Park today. We are at the beautiful Christchurch Park. My daughter and I totally love this place. We are at my favorite tree in Christchurch Park. I often sit here and read books. The current one that I'm reading is my very own self-promotion. And the main reason why my daughter and I love Christchurch Park so much is because of the beautiful trees. And there is a lovely pond out there with a lot of ducks. A very nice play area for kids. And right here is the Christchurch Mansion which is absolutely free. Heading towards the pond now and especially the bench where my daughter and I usually sit and feed the ducks. So it's a beautiful pond with a lot of a variety of ducks. This one especially is the Mandarian duck, a very colorful duck that I have never seen before. A pretty duck which usually catches everyone's attention and there are a lot of photographers clicking pictures of this duck especially. Uh, there are many other ducks, they were not around today. Moving on to the play area my favorite area and i think my daughter paris's favorite area as well so this is uh, one of the swings that i totally love i call it the mother daughter swing where paris and i sit together and somewhere i think i enjoy the park more than my daughter maybe i am playing more than her most of the times so a little bit about uh, Christchurch Park. So Christchurch Park is uh, hardly 500 meters away from the Ipswich Town Centre. And on a bright and sunny day, it's the best place to have a good relaxing day um, and have a picnic with your entire family. Apart from the play area, there's huge, huge places that you must have seen where you can simply sit in the lawn and uh, enjoy a good pa a picnic family day. Uh, we usually get our uh, lunch and once Paris is done playing, we will uh, have a picnic. I will read my book. She will play with her toys. And then if she's still not uh, satisfied playing, we go back to the play area. She enjoys uh, some more time there. And then finally we head home. A small tip here, you need to always make sure that you have checked the weather forecast before you uh, go to anywhere in Ipswich for that matter. Um, just to be sure that you're carrying the right amount of clothes or carrying spare uh, uh, warm clothes with you or you can be really miserable. You have to listen to this video recording of my daughter feeding the ducks. Very good girl, very good girl, I'll take two pieces for you. One is for you, 